The I sound is usually mispronounced as the vowel E. Say the word him. Him. Place the tip of your tongue against the bottom teeth. Now take the tip of your little finger and put it on your bottom teeth so it's touching the front of the tongue. Arch the front of your tongue toward your finger. E. 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 He. E. He. Now drop the arch in the tongue back approximately an eighth of an inch. This is I. I. Him. I. Him. E. He. I. Him. E. He. I. Him. Imagine that your hands are representing the articulators of speech. Your left hand is the floor of the mouth, your fingertips the bottom teeth, and your right hand is your tongue. Put the tip of the tongue behind the bottom teeth, arch the front of the tongue forward, and say E. 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 He. E. He. Now drop the arch in the tongue back approximately an eighth of an inch. I. Him. I. Him. Let's go back and forth. E. He. I. Him. E. He. I. Him. Feel the difference between these sounds in the following words. Seat. Set. B. Bet. T. Ten. And now, say these sentences. Inside the theater, sit in your seat. It's good to be a bit interesting. She keeps the T in a thin tin. And with that information, I is easily implemented. Let's repeat that. Here's the floor of the mouth. Here are your bottom teeth, and this is your tongue. Put the tip of the tongue behind the bottom teeth. Arch the front of the tongue forward and say, E, he, and drop the arch one eighth of an inch. I, him, E, he, I, him. You can feel the placement by taking the tip of your finger and putting it on your tongue. E, he, I, him. Great. Let's continue.